Hello everybody and in today's video for fall 2022 I'm sharing the best shoes for wide flat feet for women over 50. If you're new here I'm Kathy. I'm 54 years old and I do petite apple body fashion videos as well as makeup for women over 50. So today I'm sharing some of my favorite shoes for fall. I'm a very casual person. I have a very casual lifestyle. I work from home so I don't need to wear a lot of stilettos or heels or things to the office. So the shoes that I'm recommending are more for like a casual lifestyle. And I'm only recommending shoes that are comfortable because I have flat feet, I have wide feet. I am a size 10. So in some shoes, it's like, just give me the box to wear. It's probably easier that way. And I know that some of my shoes are a little on the pricey side, but I will try and find a more budget-friendly option if I can. But I believe in spending money in shoes because they hold up my body. I've had plantar fasciitis in the past. It's painful, I don't want it. So that's why I spend a little more, bit more money on my shoes. Okay, so the first shoe that I recommend for fall is a slip-on sneaker. They're so cute. I have them in navy, I have them in black. They're great with nice joggers or they're great with jeans. They're a little warmer than sandals because, you know, in September the weather's getting a little more chillier where I live, so we wanna keep our toes nice and cozy. So these slip-on sneakers are great and I like the brand by Vionic. I like Vionic because all of their shoes are for people like me that have flat feet and need some support. So they have some built-in support in their footbed and the footbed is removable if you have your own orthotics and you would prefer to wear those in your shoe. The next shoe that I love, this brings me back to being a teenager and they are Boat Shoes by Speary. I think these are so, so cool and they're great for in the early fall. If it's still warm enough that you want to wear shorts, it looks great with boat shoes. They look great with jeans. I like to wear mine barefoot with my jeans or joggers. They're just a nice, cool look. The ones that I have are by Speary. Okay, the next shoes that I have for you, I just love animal print. So I think every woman needs some leopard print shoes in her life. To me, they are neutral. Leopard print shoes are great to wear with jeans or black pants. They just allow your personality to come through. I know that someone is going to tell me <laughs> that I've said in so many videos, your shoes should match your pants. And yes, that is true but you don't have to follow the rules 100% of the time. They're merely suggestions. So I like to have a little bit of fun. I like to have my personality come through with my shoes. And that is why I like these leopard print loafers. So it's okay to let loose once in a while and have some fun with our style because style is an expression of who we are. Okay, the next pair, I actually have to get a pair. I don't own a pair and they are nude pumps. And the reason why I chose nude is because they should really match your skin tone because if you're wearing a dress, it just looks nice, it uh, elongates the leg. So I'm on the look for a good nude pump. And if you know of some that are comfortable with like a nice block heel, I don't like stiletto heels or anything too high because I'm not used to wearing heels, be sure to let us know in the comments. The next shoe that every woman should own for fall are black heels because you never know when you might have to go to an event or a funeral. They just kind of elevate any black dress pants that you might have rather than wearing flat loafers, which I tend to gravitate to 99% of the time because I like to be comfortable. But if I'm going to say a funeral, I would put on pumps with black pants and it just, you know, looks a little more respectful and uh, a little more dressy. And it's so important to find a heel height that fits for you. I myself could never wear a stiletto. I could never wear like a three inch heel, I'm just not used to it. And at this point in my life, I'm not looking to impress anybody. I'm all about impressing myself and being comfortable in my clothes. So I think it's really important to find a heel height that works for you. Can I ask you a favor? I am trying desperately to get to 40,000 subscribers. So if you have not yet subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. It would really, really help me out. Thank you. Okay, the next one, I'm pretty sure a lot of people probably own and they are black loafers. They could be brown loafers. I just 
like black because most of my pants are black but if you wear brown pants you know a nice tan loafer would look great too so black loafers you can wear them casually like with joggers you can wear them with jeans you can wear them with dress pants they are so so versatile the next ones are perfect if you live in a climate where it rains a lot or you know the early part of winter where it's like snow and then it turns to rain and it's slushy i own a lot of footwear by ugg I love Ugg. So, so comfortable. Sizing is always consistent. I wear 10. I recently picked these up in the Nordstrom sale. I wasn't sure how I was going to like them. I love them. I kept them. I can't wait to wear them. Well, I don't want winter coming, but you know what I mean. They're so, so cute and they're going to be perfect for November when it rains a lot. They're waterproof. They are Habsburg Waterproof Duck Boot by Ugg. They are waterproof. They're lined with faux shearling. They fit true to size and they are perfect for early fall, winter days, or even in the spring when it's cool out. I love Ugg and these are adorable. The next shoe that I'm recommending for fall are some booties. Booties just look great with jeans. They just elevate the look. If you're going out on date night, if you're meeting a girlfriend for lunch, you know, they can even elevate a pair of jeans. They just make you look like you're more dressed up than just wearing jeans. I like booties with a block heel, again, because I don't like stiletto or a smaller heel. Booties just elevate. They make your outfit look more dressy. The next pair of shoes that I recommend for fall are some black lace-up sneakers. And why black? Because I just think that, say I'm running some errands and I just wanna wear my joggers, that if I put on white sneakers, it kind of screams going to the gym. But if I put on my black sneakers, it just, again, elevates the look. The black sneaker just blends in with the black leggings, with my black joggers, and it just elongates the leg, makes me look taller. And it just makes the joggers look a little dressier than if I was just, you know, schlepping around with the, you know, hot pink sneakers or something. I particularly love to wear black sneakers when I travel, especially in Europe. I just think it's a little more dressy because, I don't know, it's just a personal thing. I just like how it looks. I do have a bonus pair. They're not shoes or boots, but they are slippers. And these slippers live on my feet 365 days a year, inside and out. They are totally worth the money. And I'm talking about the Ugg slippers. This is my second pair in the last 15 years. The only reason that I got rid of my first pair was my, toe, my toes were uh, sticking through, but the sole was still like day one. I don't recommend wearing them outside in the winter. I do, but it's kind of dangerous. They're slippery, but the point is they're totally worth the money. The bottom of the shoe is a really great rubber. They last for years. They keep my feet warm in the winter. My feet don't sweat in the summer. I wear them barefoot. You can wear them with socks. They're very, very durable, very high quality, and they last forever, like I said. They're totally, totally worth the investment. So let me know what shoes you recommend for the fall, and if you have not yet subscribed, I hope that you will, and be sure to check out my other style tips videos that I will link below. I have them all together in a playlist. Thanks for watching. I'll see you soon. Bye.